The Lewis Bay Research Center in West Yarmouth has installed a demonstration project that could help make Cape Cod's biggest problem go away. That's the idea behind The Wall, a series of vertically stacked, futuristic-looking tubes housed in a 2,300-square-foot greenhouse on the Zuquarium property on Route 28. The project combines technology from a Montana company named Clearis with funding from the LaRusso Foundation and the Cape Cod Economic Development Council to research whether algae can be used to reduce the amount of nitrogen flowing into the Cape's bays and ponds. A soupy green mixture of algae and water circulates through the tubes day and night, infused with carbon dioxide and just the right amount of light from the sun or light-emitting diodes to grow the algae. The algae consumes the nitrogen that has been blamed for a decline in water quality around the Cape. It can then be harvested for use as biofuel, fertilizer, fish food, or bioplastics. The project has garnered a lot of attention from local and state officials who are grappling with ways to manage the Cape's wastewater, a task that is expected to cost billions of dollars.